Hey guys, it's Dario from Back on Track. Today I'm going to be going through a few exercises to train that core of yours. There are a million ways to train the core, but I'm going to show you four simple variations in order to get this core nice and strong. So the first exercise we're going to do is a plank, okay? So what you're going to do, you're going to come on down, you're going to place your elbows, palms down, you're going to raise your hips up. A lot of people will compensate and bring their butt too high, or they're going to come too low after they start to fatigue. What you want to do is you want to come to a nice neutral position, engage your core, draw your belly button into your spine, tuck your butt cheeks in and squeeze. And try and hold that as long as possible. So the next core variation exercise is a side plank. So what you're going to do, you're going to come onto your side, you're going to place your elbow down, you're going to try to stabilise your shoulder. All right, you don't want to bring your shoulder blade too far out, you want to keep it in a nice neutral position. Feet together, hands on hip, and you're going to raise yourself up. Okay? You'll find a lot of people will start to cheat and poke their bum out. What you want to do is bring your hips forward and tuck your butt cheeks in and keep a nice neutral line. Okay, try and hold that as long as possible. The next exercise is a rotational exercise, okay, which is really going to focus on stabilizing your core. What you're going to do, you're going to get a band or a resistance. You're going to come up into a kneeling position. You're going to draw your belly button into your spine and what you're going to do you're going to come and you're going to hold, okay? You can make it a little bit more difficult and do a bit of a pallet press. Coming forward, keeping your core engaged at all times. Make sure you're breathing. And drawing it up, okay? Right, the last exercise is going to be more, more of a flexion-based exercise. So what you're going to do, you're going to get a band and you're going to put it just above your hip joint, okay? Which is going to provide a force pulling you back, okay? What you're going to do, you're going to grab some weight. You know, it's kind of more of a modified deadlift, if anything. What you're going to do, you're going to sit up nice and straight, draw your belly button into your spine, tuck your pelvis in, and you're going to go forward. You'll feel the resistance pull you back. Once you get that pull and that end range, you're going to come back up, keep your core engaged, and you're going to come back down. Squeeze, keep your butt engaged at all times. So there you have it guys, there are four effective core exercises that you can complete at home. If you feel you're suffering from lower back pain or really lack core strength, feel free to pop on into the clinic or give us a call and um, we'll get you back on track.